I am George Paul Williams, a nurse and union leader from Liberia. I'm headed to Davos to confront a small group of people who are still making killer profits from this pandemic, pharma CEOs. The reason that Davos is angers so many people is because what it symbolises. But as the super rich get wealthier, has enthusiasm for this gathering of the global elite gone cold? Ultimately, the problem is billionaires. They pay less tax as a proportion of their income than a nurse or a cleaner does. Walking up and down the main streets of Davos, I was confronted by images of extreme wealth and luxury. It was a strange place. A place where people are happy to eat free ice cream, even if it's paid for by a guy who chopped up journalist. For me, this journey began many years ago. I saw the brutal impacts of a broken global pharmaceutical system firsthand when Ebola decimated my country of Liberia. One in ten of my health workers' colleagues died. We call on governments to speed up the search for an effective vaccine as a global public good. But our calls went unanswered. And when such things are left to the market, our lives in the global south just aren't profitable enough to save. The sad reality is big pharma firms have spent far more on erectile dysfunction products than they have on Ebola cures. Although Ebola wasn't a profitable pandemic, COVID has been a huge money-making opportunity for pharma. They started using monopoly patents to stop others from producing vaccines, slowing global supply. The eight top Pfizer and Moderna shareholders saw their stock holdings jump $10 billion last week following the discovery of the new variant. The crazy part is that over 90% of the research and development funding for these vaccines came from public funding. That means you, us, these are our vaccines and should be treated as a global public good, not a privatized monopoly. I wanted to personally ask the pharma CEOs if they would finally make these patents public so that we nurses in the global south could get them to our people as fast as possible. So I tried to make my way inside. I want to know if I can have an entry to have some access to meetings going on. I didn't know how uh, is it possible to, uh, to find an, an an entry. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Okay. There's no um, open no. forum. There is no possibility to uh, to enter. Okay. Okay. Thank you. While dozens of CEOs got a chance to spread their wisdom, not a single essential worker sat on any of the panels. Clearly, this isn't a place for us workers who are the ones who actually make the world economy work. Can we get in? Okay. As I was turned away, Faso CEO Albert Bola was inside making a big Davos announcement. His cooperation Faso will start selling drugs at cost to some countries in the global south. But let's be clear. This isn't solidarity. It's not even charity. As the old saying goes, Bola is agreeing to sell us a fish a day at cost while maintaining his monopoly over the fishing rod. Hello, sir. 
I'm George, and I'm a nurse. I want to know what's happening here. Um, this is a private event, okay. um, and it was an uh, invite only, so I can't have you. Thank you very have much. Have a great day. Thank you. Can I come inside? Yeah. The score is fair enough. Unfortunately, we are booked, fully booked. You are fully booked. So we have worker kit coming. Because of several reasons. Thank you very much. Sir. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Um, is this open up? I can go in? No, it's like a, a meeting space. It's a meeting space. Yes. Ah, okay. Okay. Thank you. Walking up and down in the rain, I felt like I was catching a cold. So I decided to look for a way home. Blue Bear, your private check. Hi, Anne. How can I help? Um, I am George. And I, want, I want to know about um, a private jet charter from Switzerland to Liberia. You would like to know the, the price of the jet coming from Nigeria? No, Switzerland to Liberia. But how many passengers? One. Will you be traveling with any pets? Perhaps a dog or a cat? No, no. Okay, so for this one, we have a Hawker 900 XP. Mm -hmm. Pricing on this one way trip is $77,000 for this one way trip. For a one way trip. Okay. Um, I'm a nurse. Is there any discount rate, please? You can have a discount of 10% if you're going to sign up for a member. Someone who has no problem paying that private jet bill is Albert Berlin. He took home more than $20 million in 2021. For me to earn that much money as a nurse, I will have to work every single day in the hospital until 6000 180. Surely now that Bola and the billionaires have cashed in, our governments will pass a waiver on vaccine patents, right? Well, almost right. Over 100 countries have backed the patent waiver first proposed by India and South Africa over two years ago. But a few governments led by Germany, UK, Switzerland, and the EU Commission continuing to block this waiver. They are pushing for a watered-down version which won't fix this problem. Leaders at Davos, like Germany's Olaf Scholz, are still putting farmers' profits ahead of people's lives. Unless they change their position, they will have blood on their hands. <laughs> it started raining again, but luckily, I was finally led into one of the side events. The crowd here were different. They seemed much friendlier. They had nice hats. I had a big cup of cacao to warm my bones. And suddenly, I started to see things differently. These pharma CEOs are geniuses. They have found a way to turn our pain into gain. Why are people around the world clapping for us health workers? We are the losers of the crisis. It was time to clap for the winners. Now I knew what I had to do. <laughs> 